Welcome, Ophiosis. I want to say thank you for being here. Thank you for being back. All right, Ophiosis, you have the Eight of Pentacles in your um in your house. The energy of the Eight of Pentacles in your house is good. Um, it is upright and that is powerful. You have the Sun in Virgo. The sun in Virgo. So, um, wonderful alignment of energies is going to be coming up. Ophiosis, this is really wonderful and positive. Um, so, Ophiosis, you are really recognizing um, what is transpired. People are now recognizing the deceptiveness. Um, this is a two of swords and the deceptiveness of a uh, Aries Lee or a Sagittarian person. They now recognize. Uh, what this person tried to do, okay? So, the sun in Virgo, um, this is a really positive energy um, with the eight of pentacles, and it's about uh, prudence, perseverance, craftsmanship, and um, having a positive, positive support system where a Virgo is really standing their grounds in order to balance out a situation. Now, what we're recognizing is that a lot of you Ophiosis is going to be happy, happy because uh, some sort of a situation where a Virgo is trying to resolve a situation and helping some of you Ophiosis to resolve a situation. And it's as if this Vir Virgo um, is now recognizing that an Aries leader, a Sagittarian person, whoever this person is, uh, tried to create some sort of a situation and uh, it's now uh, people are not recognizing so they're recognizing some sort of a secrecy um a virgo is showing up some sort of a secrecy of a libra all right so let's look at the first energy now the energy of the ten of cups is always always a really positive positive energy um when the ten of cups comes up in your reading in the upright position it is Mars in a Pisces. Now, when the energy of Mars is in Pisces, is that Mars, a Pisces, is uh, together, is going to be working together with a Virgo in order to end a situation for an Aries or a Sagittarian person. And the problem is that uh, whoever um, the Pisces is, uh, is now recognizing together with a Virgo that an Aries Leo or a fire sign person had a lot of secrets. And you, Ophiosis, is co-creating and collaborating with these with the Pisces because uh, the Pisces is going to be like firing a Virgo because they recognize, uh, no, uh, could be, but a Virgo is going to be saying, hey, Pisces, I am not the problem. The young Aries, the or fire sign person is the problem. So truths are now being revealed because uh, people are now recognizing what this uh, young um, hair sign person have done. And um, the secrets um, that a young air, sign, uh, air sign person have carried together with a Libra. So they're now recognizing um, that a Libra together, uh, some sort of a discrimination. All right. So trust, discernment and discrimination. Um, and a Virgo is now discern and is not trusting an Aries the or a fire sign person. So the moon in Libra is really positive because the moon in Libra is revealing the secrecy of an air sign person. And a Virgo is now recognizing that. So I see that you, Ophiosus, is ending a situation. Together, you're working with a Pisces in order to end a situation. So whoever this Pisces is, you Virgos or real you Virgos and you Ophiosus are really collaborating um, with a with a Pisces. So what you're recognizing in this three months is that uh, um, this energy of uh, um, Pisces, this Pisces energy, this uh, um, Pisces energy is really coming up and it's showing up. Uh, Mars in Pisces. And 
Um, the Pisces is like, I'm, I'm ending the secrecy. I, I want to stop the situation that is going on. And a Virgo is in the middle and is saying, hey, Pisces, let's get out of the situation because the situation is not looking good from where we are sitting. This situation, we need to step back. So I see the center of this Virgo. The sun is in Virgo and the Virgo is saying, Pisces, Ophiosis. And I see Ophiosis, you're like the boss or you're like the supervisor or you're like um, someone who is investigating a situation and is recognizing um, what has been happening and what has been transpiring. And you are now seeing that whoever an Aries D or a fire sign person is, together with a Libran, have a lot of secrets. So, so it's about the squatel is centered around secrecy of a Pisces, secrecy of a Virgo, and the um the 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 most uh, the most imprivalent uh, situation is uh, an Aries Leo or a Sagittarian person, and this person is a very young person. Now, as we look, we see that a lot of you Ophiosis is going to be happily co-creating and they're a scorpion and recognizing a cancer and recognizing the secrets that a cancer together with a Aries, the or Sagittarian, old and a Libran. So it's as if you Ophiosis, the more that you people knock on a door, the more one door open is the door is the more that a lot of you are recognizing a whole lot of secrecy of these people and what these people were doing. And it's as if a Pisces secrets is now out. Whoever the Pisces is and whatever is transpiring, their secrets is now out. And the Pisces is going to be saying, hey, Ophiosas, let's work together because a Virgo have information and a Virgo is now aware of what it was happening and transpiring. So, you know, Ophiosis is as if you are going to be on the team of the Pisces and the Virgo um, because the Pisces is going to be let you, letting you in on secrets of a Cancer and Air and Aries, the or Sagittarian and a Aquarian. And then people are going to be now recognizing that this Virgo have so how comes bounce and pounce up on things that was happening and transpiring and how all of these people have co-created to create some sort of a problem. Now this Virgo is very serious because this Virgo is now recognizing um, who this Aries Leo or fire sign person is. This Virgo is on top of their game and this Virgo is now recognizing how unacceptable uh, um, this person is and what was going on and how this person have basically <coughs> recreate a situation um, and how these three people uh, sort of a, have the secrets, um, how they network and secret, secretly do things without other people knowing. And it's as if you, um, you Ophiosis is going to be co-creating with the Virgo in order to release this. So in the month of the first month, the month of July, I see that you Ophiosis is going to be co-creating with a Pisces and a Pisces is going to co-create with a Virgo because they are now getting to the bottom of some sort of a secrecy of an Aries Leo or a Sagittarian person. And people are now recognizing and seeing what was happening and what was transpiring. And this person is now opening up and showing up their ends uh, in order to recognize uh, um, what was going on. So there, there is a lot of things that was kept back, ladies and gentlemen, and you have to be aware. Whatever is transpiring, I see a Virgo in the center. And this Virgo, it is now getting to the bottom of some sort of a secrecy. And whatever the secrecy is, you Ophiosis with this Virgo is going to be reveal the secrets and is going to be resolving the secrecy because it's coming out because a Virgo is now really recognizing 
the secrets of a, a Libra and an Aries or a Sagittarius and a Cancer and is now getting to the point that they're now understanding that, hey, these three people have been on common ground. So I see a Pisces is going to be letting a Virgo um, knows um, to let go of a Leo. Um, um, you know, fire this Leo, get rid of this Leo, um, you know, move this Leo out of a department or some sort of a containment, okay? Because this Virgo is like uh, this Leo have a secrecy and the secrecy is that this Leo didn't get a position in the correct way. This Leo is not aware of their work. It's not, it doesn't have to be a Leo. It's an Aries Leo or a Sagittarian person. So you got to be aware of this situation, what is transpiring and how um, this situation has been playing for a very long time. And it's as if you Ophiosus is on top of your game because you Ophiosus is really recognizing and finding out uh, um, the secrecy of a cancer. Okay. The secrecy. A Pisces is now recognizing the secrecy of a cancer. And it's as if these three people are all young people. And the Virgo is a more old mature person who is recognizing um, how these people get around, get jobs, get into corporations. Uh, and it's now finding out their secret. So I see your Ophiosus is going to be working in accordance with a Pisces and a Virgo in order to release um, a situation that has been going on and like moving yourself out. Um, it's coming down where a lot of people is going to be recognizing um, that uh, someone, um, some, some of you, some of you Ophiosus is going to be recognizing a young person have a lot of secrets. And this young person is looking as a cancer and this young person is looking as a Leo for some of you. This young person is looking as an Aries for some of you. This young person is looking as a um, Sagittarian for some of you. This young person is looking as if they are a, a, a Libran. But all of these people have co-created on something and is having a secret going on and it is going to be coming out. All right. So um, in the month of August uh, and before August, this could be coming out. September is a is a month where you, Virgo, uh, you Ophiosos are going to be sitting well. You're going to be sitting well. And I see in the month of September, uh, you Ophiosos is going to be firing a Libran and a Aries Leo or Sagittarian. OK, you're deciding to fire them, get rid of them and wipe the slate clean and then move forward. So again, congratulations, Ophiosis. You Ophiosis have been doing very well. Um, your frequency is very high and your frequency is that you're very much in a positive alignment of energy. When it comes up to your frequency, um, you are just uh, um, blazing um, through um, your focus, your sharp, um, you're clear, you are aware of what you're doing, and you're on the right track. Okay, so um, that is good. All right, so we have two extra energy. Yes, so they're going to be finding out what a Libran has done. The broken glass is in luck for a long years, and it has to do with a Libran. Okay, so this Libran. The secrets of this Libran about a whole lot of money. Then we are seeing six and two, eight. A Sagittarian is going to be blocked. Okay. So whoever the Sagittarian is, they are going to be blocked because their secrets is now out. And people are now recognizing what the Sagittarian have done. And whoever the Sagittarian is... I've accumulated a whole lot of, and if you notice, you the Virgo sits so good because the Virgo recognized that, yes, lady, you went a little bit too far. Okay, so this is going to be something that is coming up. So ladies and gentlemen, a Sagittarian is going to be blocked. There is no question about this. Um, The Sagittarian, whoever the Sagittarian is, they went too far in order to create a whole lot of problems. And the eight of ones is communication 
in um, Sagittarius is going to be blocking this person. And I see bad luck is coming up for the Sagittarian. I got to go. If you want to see the extended of this reading, follow me to the other side. Namaste. Until then.